How's it going everybody? Combo here. Today we got 5 quick tips with the Rat King. Let's not waste any time and get right into it. Starting things out at number 1, we have perk activation range. For those that don't know, if you and one other person have Rat King equipped or within a certain range, you're going to get a slew of buffs, most importantly being fire rate. That range is going to be 7 meters, so try to stay close when you're using it. Next up at number 2, we have the surprise attack functionality. Because you're probably going to be using Rat King on Void subclass, essentially the Astral Harvest fragment allows you to get a precision kill on a weakened target, making an orb of light. This in turn activates the surprise attack mod, picking up that orb, reloading Rat King will give you a 3 tap kill because of the bonus damage. Next up at number 3, we have subclass synergy. So, the Rat King exotic perk that allows you to go invisible will in fact stack with the Echo of Persistence. Typically, you're going to get that 7 second invisibility timer, but when using Echo of Persistence, you're essentially going to get 9. This is very good for the Rat King, and there's really no reason you shouldn't be using it. Next up at number 4, we have weapon synergies. Now, the best for this is going to be bows, grenade launchers, and snipers, simply because Rat King does a very good job at cleaning up after these weapons, and the more cleaning up you do with Rat King, the more time you're going to have that invisibility buff, which is always a better rather than worse thing. And finally, number 5, we have the exotic synergies. With Warlock, it's going to be the Ophidian Aspect. This essentially just does really good at those weapon pairings, allowing you to clean up kills a lot easier with Rat King. Next up for Titans, it's going to be the Peregrine Greaves. Now before you call me crazy, the combo with this is get a kill with Rat King, go invisible, and this is going to allow you to do an insta-kill invisible shoulder charge. This works especially well on Void Titan, as this is going to give you an overshield with the right fragments and aspects, and be very oppressive. And finally with Hunter, you can in fact use the new exotic that gives you a damage boost when coming out of invisibility, but I like grabbed and forfeit more because you get a kill, and you're going to get almost 12 seconds of invisibility, which is just outright amazing.